Hey diggers, I got something here. I don't know what it is, but it's like right over here. Let me double check where it is. Cause... All right, right there. Wiped it off and I lost it. There he is. Okay, I don't know if you can see that. But there's something right there in the hole. Let's see if I can pop this out. See what that is. Oh, look at that. It's an anchor. I'm not sure if that's plated or. That's awesome. Right here in the grass line. Cool find. I wasn't sure if I'd find anything in this place. I found a little a silver ring here before, but I'm not sure if that's real silver. It kind of looks like it's got some plating over there, but I don't know if that's dirt or not, but pretty cool. I'll take it. Cool. I guess I'll see you at the next. Have a great day. Bye. Okay, I'm still in that field. I've just gotten like a bunch of pencil erasers and uh, a few coins and uh, just got this. Thought it was gold at first when it was, it was actually hooked onto my uh, spade when I dug in the hole. It's got the, I think, yeah, right there you can see the letter C is on there, but I can't read the rest. Not sure if there's anything written on this side, but pretty cool. I think it was a key thing, like hooked onto somebody's belt maybe, but pretty cool. Hopefully it'll have some writing on it, but yeah. Guess I'll see you at the next. It was going down like like two inches right here. Have a good day. Hey Diggers, it's Tony Dayski. I'm at the field where I got I think three rings with that uh, silver top and it was like gold uh, plate filled. I got it like over there and a couple other rings that were I think all junk, and I just got this when I got here. It's first find. I'm not even sure what this is. I don't know if it's a dog tag or if it's actually like somebody's uh, pendant or something like that. There's something written right there. I just can't uh, see what's on there because it's kind of like faded. But yeah, I'll get a good look at this thing and I'll be right back. Hey diggers, I'm still at the campground and uh, I just got, I think a surface fine. It looks like a ring right there. Just went right over it and uh, yep, looks like it's a ring. Maybe a homemade one or something. Looks like it's silver. Pretty cool. Not even going down like, you know, not even an inch, just in the soil, in the grass. Very cool. Hopefully there'll be more here and I'll see you the next. Bye. Hey diggers, I'm still at the uh, campground and I just got this little tiny, looks like a silver dolphin earring, right in the ground. That was a pain in the ass to find, but got it. Very happy about the find. Hopefully there'll be more here because that was only like four inches down. So have a great day. I'll see you at the next. Okay, I'm still at that uh, camp. I just decided to come to the field where I got a bunch of silver before, and I just got a find right there. It's pretty much on the surface, if you look. Looks like a ring. I don't know if it's a uh, fake or not. I haven't checked it, but it kind of looks plated to me. I don't know. I'm gonna take a good look at it, and I'll be right back, because it was just right here under the grass, screaming an 85, so I don't know if it's silver or not. Be right back. Hey diggers, it's Tony Gadeski here. I'm back at the camp. It's uh, September 2nd, 
Memorial Day weekend, and I just uh, got my first target, and it's a memorial. It's a not a memorial. It's a weedy. 1913. I think that's what that says. Pretty cool. Going down like four inches right here in the hole. Awesome find. Yeah, hopefully there'll be more here and I'll see you at the next. Have a great day. Bye. Hey diggers, it's Tony Dodeski. I'm just digging this school that I've never dug before. I tried digging it this winter, but it was too frozen in the ground, so I just came back and I just got this significant find right here in the hole. It looks like it's some sort of pendant. It says Hatchimals. Huh. It's got a little diamond thing on the front. It looks like it's open. Open it. Oh, oh, there's something inside of it. Some little, is that a ghost? Oh, some little penguin. Pretty cool. And I guess like a little mirror inside of it. That's pretty cool. Well, I got a quarter here so far and a couple of pieces of change and garbage, but yeah, very happy about the find. Hopefully there'll be more here. I'll see you at the next. Have a great day. Bye. Hey diggers, I'm at the camp again. I just uh, helped them locate a pipe and I got to uh, go detecting and here's my first find of the day. Looks like the smallest buckle I've ever seen. It's still uh, complete and everything, pretty cool. Screaming 65 over here, right along the bush line, so pretty cool. Going down about two inches. See you at the next. Hey diggers, Tony Dayski. I'm still at that uh, camp, just doing the lake. Got around these uh, trees, there's a little, uh, I guess, rope swing right here. Dug a hole, I thought I missed it, and it came out on my spade. So there it is. Let's see if I can get it off, I think it's a silver. Wow, I found a very uh, similar ring to this. So uh, yeah, I think this is silver, safe to say. Pretty cool. I don't see any markings, but I don't see any corrosion either. So, yeah, let me uh, get a good look at this thing and clean it up and I'll be right back. Okay, I could see something like written right in there, but my eyes aren't that good. So I'm assuming that's a silver, uh, 925 in there, but it definitely looks like it's like a topaz type uh, ring. Pretty cool. I was hoping I'd find some silver today because all I've got today was just a bunch of uh, wheat scents. I mean, my whole pocket. Let's see. What did I get today? That's all I got today. So, like three Wheaties, I think it is, or maybe four. I think there's another one in my pocket, but yeah. That and, uh, yeah, silver ring. Pretty cool. I'll take it. See you the next. Have a great day.